It's 739, and in this morning's digital download, it's a way you can celebrate our planet ahead of Earth Day. Yeah, digital reporter Alexandra Ba, who is here to explain how NASA is encouraging us to learn more about our home. Alex. Good morning. You know, the Earth needs some love, and NASA is on a mission to get it adopted by all of us. The Space Administration is inviting people all around the world to virtually adopt a slice of Earth. In all, it's an effort to get us to learn more about the planet as Earth Day approaches. Now, there are about 64,000 locations up for grabs. Each piece is about 55 miles wide. Visitors get assigned a random Earth chunk, and the adoption comes with a nifty certificate that you can share on social media. That's mine, a nice little parcel of the North Pacific Ocean, so that's fancy. You can also check out more in-depth satellite data of your location with NASA's Worldview feature. The goal, NASA says, is to get all the pieces adopted at least once by Earth Day, which is April 22nd. Of course, what I love is NASA makes it a point to say, just because you adopt a little chunk doesn't mean you own it, which is sad because I could have used that North Pacific piece. You know what the you know? fishing is like there? I look at your, it's like could've they just, make whole you know. TV shows about fishing in that that's area. Right, that's right, that's the great right. catch, greatest catch, what is it? Greatest cat. Uh, the, uh, greatest. Great. Yeah, yeah. That'll work, That'll but then you'd have I'll to clean it. You'd have to clean it as oh, yeah. well. Clean, though. What? No. That, yeah. that little parcel of land. So yeah, I feel oh. sorry who, for whoever gets the big junk patch in the yeah. middle of the oh, Pacific. Oh, with the swirling. Yeah, the big, yeah, I don't yeah, want that. yeah, yeah. You don't want that. Yeah. All right. Well, thanks a lot, Alex. You're welcome. <laughs>